For a living, Brad. Well, I'm not for a living, Brad. We're going to teach you now. And I'm going to look at. We're going to start from the first seat and work our way up. Sitting in a normal chair, firm chair like this. Typically, your feet <laughs> want to be flat down just like this. Oh, it's not out here, but we're going to get take the weight off the weight. And then here's the core right here. Big Mac Whopper, Big Mac Whopper, under the cheeseburger, Big Mac Whopper, under the cheeseburger. Brad. Bob's going to help out. Can I show one thing though, Brad? Sure. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Can you stand up real quick? Yep. Down. Sure. You now, when you're taller like me, I actually always want to make sure that I actually always want to make sure that I have a chair that's maybe a little bit higher because of <laughs> And you got it's gonna make you uncomfortable. Don't interrupt you. Not have those interruptions. Keep me on my toes and get people informed. So hip yes, and low back, they work together. Can you see that red line, Lonnie? That that right now I've got a pretty good pressure. Sure. A little bit, Brad. There, you there go. we go. And this is a lot of people. Round out the pelvis. And the low back is really what I'm talking about causing problems. So make sure you're Brad. up like this. And look what it does Brad. to my shoulders. Yeah, look Brad. what the pelvis did. Right. Yeah. So Brad. To the Brad. Back. one thing you can do is you can take a lumbar support. You can use a Greetings. Put in there and boy, and that really feels nice and it uh, reminds you. Quandale Dingle. And helps you get into that. Quandale Dingle. Exactly. Um, a lot of times this is, you know, it depends on. Quandale Dingle. Again, notice the shoulder. When I'm in that good position, I lock it in with that lumbar support. My shoulders and automatically go into a much better position. Okay, now if you're sitting working at a computer workstation, what we oftentimes are, Bob, why don't you show? We're just going to use a little model. Imagine Let's say this is the screen. Okay, Bob, I don't want to look at okay. it. Okay. Oh my God! <laughs> oh. Shoulders back, and look at my head, head, head. position. Head, head, head. Over the top of the head, head, head. as opposed to head, head, head. forward position, putting a lot of stress back. There you go. Now, the other thing is when you're in this perfect posture, you don't want to stay locked in this posture for more than 20 minutes. Wow! Because if it's nice to take this out and you can slouch a little bit and stretch. Get up and stretch a little bit. You, you may not be as efficient, at least you don't think you are, but you're going to become more efficient because you really want to make an excuse for getting up and sitting. You know, every morning, I'd say even 10 minutes, sure, yeah, so. the job permits. But you know, one thing is people say, Oh, I feel so weird. This is right. uncomfortable. Teach your kids good posture and it'll be a payoff in the future. What'd you say about that, Bob? I, th I think you're right, Brad, for one. Greetings, Quandale Dingle.